So I guess this whole story and fascination of sheep hunting started when I was nine years old in Montana, uh, where we were originally from. And I remember dad and I were up in Glacier National Park and he, we, we were driving down the road and we came around this corner and there was this whole band of rams standing right on the road of these big horn sheep. And I'd never seen one before. And I just remember seeing these sheep and being like, that is one of the coolest animals I think I've ever seen. And uh, anyways, we stopped and dad's kind of pointing out what a big one looks like. And, and we get to talking and he was saying, yeah, it would be a lifetime of applying to draw a sheep tag in Montana. And then the success rate of even hunting them is pretty low, despite the animals being right in front of us on the road. And so uh, he kind of sparked my interest even at a young age. Um, with this almost untouchable animal that is super challenging to hunt and even being lucky enough to draw the tag. So we get to the point where um, 12 years old, I think, you're able, you're legal enough to hunt in Montana. And that was the first thing. I was like, Dad, I want to start applying for sheep tags. I want to be a sheep hunter. And so, you know, he kind of laughed and did start applying, but. In 1997, we moved to Alaska, and one thing that actually was like, kind of enticed my decision with the move was, Dad said, hey, by the way, you don't have to draw for sheep up in Alaska. Um, they have over-the-counter tags up there. It was like, what? No way. So we move up to Alaska, and uh, this was 16, I think, was the first legal year I could hunt up here. and. Right out of the gate, you know, dad was a bush pilot and stuff, or done enough flying to call himself somewhat of a bush pilot. Flew us out to a spot, and off we went up into the mountains uh, on a three day hike to get up where the rams were. And I ended up shooting a, this, this sheep, and I just remembered at that point, on top of that mountain, standing there with that sheep and my dad, I will be a sheep hunter for the rest of my life as long as I can physically do it. And here we are. 20 years later, and I've been very blessed and fortunate enough to hunt and harvest multiple rams up here in Alaska. And um, uh, now, going down to Mexico for this hunt, um, for the desert sheep, is one of the required four for the Grand Slam. And uh, if I'm able to get this ram, then it puts me one shy of the Grand Slam. And, uh, means a lot to me. Dad's no longer here anymore. He actually passed away a few years ago in an airplane accident up here in Alaska. And um, you know, he's not here for the hunt physically, but he's with me wherever I go spiritually. And uh, this will be sweet if we're able to pull this off.
<laughs> really? <laughs> One shot. All right. The Thanksgiving shell. The Thanksgiving bullet. Thanks. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. This is an amazing day. He'd be so proud. I love you, Dad. I wish you were here. Thank you, God. for my family, my friends, the opportunities, especially for your son Jesus who came here for my salvation because I didn't deserve it. <laughs>